common criticism I have seen of Boruto is that it is not gritty enough. And one of the major appeals of Part 1 Naruto was how gritty and dark it could be at times. And now I would like to talk about why Boruto starting off gritty would completely ruin the series. I think the thing a lot of people are forgetting is that to have a real dark atmosphere, bad things need to happen. And bad things means the world isn't peaceful. And I feel like if we were thrown into a world where there were people like Zabuza running around that had killed their own classmates in a graduation test and made a myth village, I feel like if we were running around bumping into people like that right away, we would all really end up looking at the series of Naruto and being like, wait a minute, so Nagato was right! This is what many people are forgetting. Boruto is the story of a generation after Naruto, and the whole goal in Naruto was so the next generation didn't have to experience the same suffering this generation did. If you had people like Zabuza running around, then you could safely say that Naruto failed. And we would really be like, wait, hold on a minute, this stuff is still happening? So what was the point in this series then? Because we're clearly not in a peaceful world, so what did Naruto accomplish? I feel like what this is doing is showing us the error of peace, and it's making us see how easy these kids have it. Now I think a lot of people don't seem to be considering the long-term storytelling effect they can have. While Naruto and Sakura had never fought in a war by the time Part 2 got to the 4th Great Ninja War, they had fought against multiple members of a terrorist organization and one of the legendary Sanin twice and had lost to their teammate. They had both been through enough that they were able to handle the ramifications of war relatively well. Naruto did have a little bit of a breakdown, but he not to snatch him out of it. The problem I have with everybody saying Boruto needs to be lighthearted is they're not considering how great it will be when Naruto eventually gets taken out. Once Naruto is eventually taken out, and the villains are like, the error of peace is over, we can have all these characters who have no idea what a war-torn world is like. They had no idea what it's like to live in a world that isn't peaceful. A world that isn't lighthearted and cheerful. And it can be like a snap to reality. I think that's what they're trying to go for. Because right now, wouldn't it just be very, very jarring if out of nowhere somebody just showed up, killed Naruto, and was like, peace, the age of peace is over, guys. That's what's gonna happen, guys. Eventually, Naruto is the pillar of peace. Naruto is the thing holding the peace together, in my opinion. I know everybody else will still work together, but I think the main thing is Naruto's positive attitude. It is Naruto that created this era, and the era will die with Naruto. And I feel like from a narrative standpoint, this is actually genius, because then we will be all used to this lighthearted show, and then when the era of peace ends, we're gonna be we're gonna feel it with the character. We're going to see the character go through this major point of character development when they need to learn this is the real world. Naruto isn't here to keep us safe anymore. Everything is ending. There's a reason for this, and that's because if Boruto started out very bad, it wouldn't be different enough from Naruto. Is it going to be the story of people that had no idea? Is the story of ungrateful little brats who probably are going to think they have it really hard and then war's going to break out or something or Naruto going to die, the villains will be destroyed, there'll be nobody to protect them and they're going to be like, no, we had it really easy. We were really lucky. We need to fight to get that back. This is showing us what the character will fight for. This is showing us why Boruto will fight, why Serana will fight. This is showing us the Age of Peace, and during the story, the Age of Peace will end. If Boruto started out very gritty, all that would prove is that Naruto failed. That's all that would prove. So to those saying Boruto isn't gritty enough, yeah, it isn't. But I guarantee you, if the village ends up getting destroyed, which it will happen because of what we saw in the beginning of the series, in episode 1 or chapter 1 of the manga, I guarantee you, it will get gritty, and we're going to see some real shit go down. 
But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave it a like if you did. Subscribe for more videos. The One Piece Nation signing out. Have a great day, guys.